Hmm. Those green pubes are back again. Now they've just stole an egg on there. I must inform High Command. Our land cannot fall back into their hands. Well done, Lieutenant. Assemble your unit. You have permission to use our new missile. You can also grab some armor support if that's required. Erase them from the map ASAP! Got it, sir. I'll tell my unit to get ready and I'll ask support from the armor division. Hey, Commander. I need to borrow one of your cans. I spotted a damn green camp around here with some armor support and an AA gun. Our general told me to use all available resources to get rid of them. Sure, you can take one of my tanks. We're about to hit the road and move to the west. Apparently there's some green tanks moving through the heights. Hey, Gordon! You go with the LT. He's going to need some armor support for his unit. Got it, Chief. Load those rounds faster. We have new orders. What's up, guys? It's me, IMC Productions, and today it's a very special day for the channel. Now, I know that some of you guys might be wondering, hey, IMC, like, what is so special about it? I mean, what's going on? So let me put you a little bit in context. A couple of weeks ago, I uploaded this video. Yes, the bad guys review. And apparently the company that produced those soldiers or armed civilians, whatever you want to call them, um, saw my video and they liked, you know, the fact of seeing, you know, their products in action and stuff. And they apparently liked the quality of my content. So they decided to contact me, you know, through my comment section and also through AliExpress where I originally purchased those bad guys. And they offered me a discount um, on my next purchase with them. So yeah, thanks Vikondo for kind of like sponsoring this video. <laughs> thanks for watching my videos. Uh, thanks for liking them. Uh, yeah, I mean, <laughs> it, it, I mean, I cannot believe that this is happening right now. Um, so thank you. Thank you for that amazing discount. Guys, please make sure to check their uh, Amazon store or their AliExpress profile. Um, they have some really cool action figures and also plastic army men. And they are really, they have a really good quality and they have a really decent price too, so... Yeah, go and check them out. But, well, without any further, let's get into the review. So we're going to use our trusty knife right now to open the box. Carefully, of course. Alright. So let's open the box. Alright, I need to cut a little bit more. There you go. So we're, we're gonna open this together. All right. So yeah, here we have two plastic army men sets, um, which I'm just gonna review one for this video. The other one, uh, it's gonna be in a, another different video. So, I'm gonna start with the one I'm most uh, interested about. So yeah, <laughs> I mean, yeah, it has a lot of bubble wrapping. Whoa, yeah. So we got this huge set and this uh, medium size set. Completely brand new and really, Protected, so that's that's awesome. Yeah, I'm gonna take a look at these two. <laughs> yeah, as you guys can see, yeah, here we have this mythical Pershing tank, and here we have a lot of tans and gray soldiers. So yeah, this packaging has some really interesting stuff. Um, yeah, but yeah, I'm, I'm gonna start reviewing this one right now. All right, so here we have all the pieces on display, 
And I want to start this review by showing to you guys my favorite piece of the set. So I want to start this review by showing to you guys this truck over here, which has a missile battery at the back. I mean, look, look at that, how cool that thing is. Uh, yeah, this thing could be, you know, like for destroying green uh, fighter jets or green helicopters, or probably, you know, to provide some artillery support, you know, for the tanks. I mean, wow. I mean, the truck looks really cool, although it's like a little bit small, you know, compared to the soldiers that arrived in this set. But I guess it's all right because I just, I, I bought this set, you know, more focusing into decorating more the backgrounds of my of my stop motion animation so yeah i believe uh, these trucks are gonna are gonna go with the aesthetic of frontline yeah just look at that it's not very detailed it's pretty simple but yeah that's what that's what i like about you know plastic armament toys you know how simplistic sometimes they are so yeah there you have it and now we have this truck over here with a radar dish. I know that some of you guys might be commenting or saying right now like, nah, I mean, this one is just pretty simple. I mean, yeah, it's cool. The fact, you know, that the radar dish, you know, moves around. But I mean, this does not have anything, you know, to defend itself or it doesn't look like really interesting. Well, that's the reason why you attach one of these at the back. <laughs> you know, to maybe uh, send this missile to a specific location, <laughs> maybe. So yeah, I mean, I believe that these two go together and, and it looks awesome. So well, um, here we have this missile with his launching ramp which goes up and down in various different angles so that's that's really cool look at that that looks awesome the missile is also detachable so that's really really cool let me just it's kind of tricky though but yeah there you go <laughs> you can detach it and maybe you know like make it a launching sequence So yeah, that's that's just great, you know. It's the first missile I have like this in my collection. So again, thanks Vicondo. Um, then we have this Hilo over here, this helicopter, which kind of looks like a Huey. Um, yeah, it has some machine guns. Whoops, I believe that these like tubes over here and over here are like machine guns or something like that or maybe like missile launchers i don't know it's up to you <laughs> yeah the rotor blades move move correctly so that's awesome the back one also moves so yeah i mean yeah it's a, it's a pretty pretty decent hilo. hilo um then we have this fighter jet which it's really simple. I mean, it's gonna do the job. And well, now moving on with the with the grays. Um, yeah, it came with a really classic cannon. You guys have seen these on my on my uh, stop motion animations. Uh, it's always nice to have more of these. Um, this cannon, yeah, it matches with the with the scale of these plastic army men, so that's good. Here's the back of the cannon. Here's the other side of the cannon. And well, yeah. Then we have this <laughs> the 
mini M48 pattern tank. I mean, <laughs> look at this little thing compared to the to the 132 scale one or like 148. I, I don't remember right now, but <laughs> look at that. Yeah, I believe like this one is like 148 and this one is like 172 or something like that. Uh, but yeah, it's very, very small. I'm probably never gonna use it for my series or probably I'm just gonna use it, you know, for background purposes. I don't know. I mean, but <laughs> it looks okay. Yeah, I mean, if, if somebody, you know, is looking to start a 172 scale tank collection, <laughs> well, here you can find one. Um, then we have this great fighter jet with like the iron cross, you know, in both of his wings. A pretty simplistic fighter jet. And this thing also came with some barracks. A really uh, classic accessory in, in the early 2000 plastic army men sets. I'm surprised that they, they're still making these. <laughs> wow. I never thought I would own one. Uh, so yeah, I mean, this one is also gonna work perfectly for background purposes. You know, if you're planning to build like a military base, that, that thing over there, it's just gonna do the job. Um, now we have the soldiers. Um, well, here we have all our poses, I mean, both sides, you know, the greys and the tens have, you know, the same, the exact same poses, so, uh, yeah, here we have a, a, a standing and shooting pose, as you guys can see. Uh, yeah, then we have these uh, sniper or kneeling and shooting soldier. All of them have a pretty like decent amount of detail. Although you can tell that these are like mass produced. Um, then we have this soldier running with his bayonet which is like my favorite pose of the set. Then we have this like commander, you know, this guy giving orders or pointing at something. He has his binoculars, his stun gun, um, you know, some ammo pouches, some like really classic uh, World War II equipment. I believe these are based on the uh, on the British paratroopers from World War II. Uh, then we have this fellow right here, which is standing and guarding. And then we have this uh, the soldier, which is about to throw a hand grenade. Here we can see his stand SMG, his hand fragmentation grenade, his ammo pouches. Yeah, these are like pretty classic pieces. Um, and of course, this head also comes with these two flags, with the German flag and the British flag. Um, so yeah, it's a pretty complete set if you ask me. It's really cool. And of course, well, it has the, the play mat, which I'm gonna show to you guys soon. Uh, but yeah, 
I mean, if I had the opportunity to rate this set, it will be like a 9.5 out of 10. Like, like the main reason why I bought this set was because I I needed, you know, these uh, these type of trucks and and also the jets and stuff like that. And I already have like hundreds of these, but if you are like really new and want to start like collecting toy soldiers, this is your set. Or if you just want to start building like a huge army of 10 soldiers or gray soldiers, this is your chance. This is a really good set. Uh, so yeah, thanks Vikanda, because all this stuff, it's gonna definitely appear in my stop motion series. Um, Thank you again for that amazing discount. And also thank you for watching my video. Thank you for subscribing and thanks for commenting. You guys are the best. And also the rest of the Plastic Iron community, you guys are awesome. Thanks for liking, subscribing and sharing my videos. We're almost about to hit 10,000 subscribers. So thank you. Thanks a lot. It's been a really amazing journey. And well, I don't have words to express how happy I am because yeah, we're really, really close to that goal. So anyways, thanks for watching. Please leave a comment, you know, drop a like if you like this video. And don't forget to subscribe to see more of this type of content. And as always, see you next time. They're here! Send the rocket! What the hell was that? I don't know! Here they come! Commence firing! Fire two more rounds and then we'll move. All right, it's time to move. Go, go, go. Let's move.